All right. Welcome to PCMD TV once again. I'm so thankful that you've taken the time to stop by my YouTube channel and check out some of the videos that I'm doing. Hopefully you've enjoyed the other videos that I've done regarding computer repair and virus removal. I want to touch on a subject that's kind of sore for me. Um, maybe it's going to be the same for some of you after you watch this video. But I just can't stand wasting money on programs that don't work. One of these programs that we're going to talk about today, and I'm going to show you how to save some money and um, get a better service on top of that, is called Norton Antivirus. We've all heard about it. It's one of the major antivirus companies out there and they do put out a good product for commercial use for businesses however um, a lot of us don't have the need for that for we're only using Norton for our home computers to protect us from unwanted spyware malware and viruses so today I'm going to show you how to remove Norton and how to install a free antivirus that's going to work better for you than uh, Norton ever did. Basically what we're going to do is go up to address bar and we're going to type in aplusComputerSolutionsLLC.com that's my website and we're going to go there to download a Norton removal tool. When you get to the website, go to my blog, click on blog, and you're going to see a post that's called Uninstall Norton with the Norton removal tool. You click on that, and you'll scroll down just a little bit towards the middle, towards the image there, and you're going to see a link that says here. You'll click that, and what you're going to do is download the Norton Removal Tool. It's not a very big file, so it should happen fairly fast for you. And just go ahead and run it, depending on what browser you're using. You may have to find it. You'll click Next and accept the agreement and then put in the CAPTCHA click next and then you'll want to click next again to begin running the tool you'll let it do its thing run its course and what it's going to do is uninstall everything that has to do with Norton from your machine if you don't use this tool and you try to uninstall it through the program remove, remove feature in Windows, what's going to happen is you're going to be left over with traces that you will not be able to uninstall without an uninstaller uh, like Revo Uninstaller. So once it's done running its course, go back to my website and you'll see below that a link for Avast or Microsoft Security Essentials. These are the free antivirus that I use and install on all my customers computers and I never have any problems with them unless obviously uh, you really go out there and ask for problems so you just click on one of those links and again it'll take you to uh, CNET downloads uh, will give you a vast and the Microsoft securities will give you Microsoft securities download a vast and install it I've already got it installed in my computer so it's going to update it for me which apparently I needed an update I'll warn you if you go to Microsoft Securities make sure that you have a legitimate copy of Windows installed on your computer of course we all do I know so after you've installed Avast you'll need to register it 
go ahead and do that. You'll have a free year for that. And uh, all you'll need to do is re-register it for uh, another year when that year's up. And it's going to ask you if you want to upgrade. Just say, no, I want the free version. And, uh, and you'll be taken care of. And there you have it. You have free antivirus. No more money out of your pocket for antivirus. It's just going to send you on your uh, way to a, a business like mine to get your computer cleaned. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. I hope you do end up saving money. And if you like it, leave a comment or whatever have you. And I appreciate, uh, again, you stopping by. Keep an eye out. We've got some really great things uh, in store for all of you YouTubers and all of you online surfers. We've got some great services that are coming. Take care. See you next time.